Hello everyone, this is Taria from Hidden Truth Tarot, and this is going to be for the Sun, Moon, and Rising Sign of Capricorn. So Capricorn, this is going to be your weekly spread through the 21st through the 27th of January 2019. I hope everyone had a blessed, wonderful, happy new year. Um, I was meditating and shuffling before I turned the camera on. The cards are ready, so we are just going to get right into it. So Capricorn, I will be clarifying with the steampunk and pulling uh, several oracle cards at the end as well. So your overall energy, Capricorn, uh, this week is going to be judgment. This is the rite of passage. This is second chances. Um, this is looking at the the cycle and and your your past uh, cycle that you've been in and making sure that you assess and make sure that you've learned you know the lessons in this cycle that was needed to be learned before you move forward as well is what I'm getting because none of us like to repeat the same thing right so I will be clarifying that as well now your circumstance well. Okay, so this is your circumstance for the week, okay? This is the situation. I just did Virgos, and Virgo had the same card in the same position. So if you have Virgo in your charts, you might want to go in and watch that video as well. Um, this is moving forward, moving past a time where maybe things were not so great. Um, leaving behind people, places, you know, things. It's, um, however this resonates with you, but um, it can be a sad time as well. You could be grieved because you're leaving behind, you know, like I said, something that you've known for a long time. This is a cycle you've been on and you've decided to move forward and start out on a new cycle, a new path. And this goes well with this judgment here, right? As given a second chance, a new fresh start. So... You could be down a little bit from that, but here we have what's driving you, and this is beautiful, and I mean, coming up in this position of what's driving you, this is a Scorpio energy right here, Capricorn. This is transformation, okay? This is what's driving you. You are ending something in your life that is no longer serving you, and you're transforming, and this is what's driving you. You're moving forward. So, your recent past is the Hierophant. Beautiful. You have a lot of major arcana here, Capricorn. So, this message is very, very, very important for someone. Um, this can be a teacher, a mentor. Um, this is some could be a tourist. This could be somebody that you've looked up to. Um, this could be the person that has helped you uh, start this uh, transformation in this new beginning right here, going on this new path as well beautiful beautiful card this is what's crowning you this is what you know okay capricorn and it's the two of cups this is the card of commitment soulmate you know card right here this can also represent uh contracts partnership as well if it's not love i will be clarifying new circumstance is the knight of swords so this is a beautiful energy this uh gemini libra aquarius this knight goes after what he wants he does not spare anyone's feeling feelings you know along the way either i mean he's as you can see he's he's an explorer he's rushing out so this could be somebody coming into your life um that is you know very blunt um it's going to be very honest with you, I feel like. This is somebody that's very intelligent as well. This could be somebody that's helping you. This could be somebody that you're partnering with. Or this could be a commitment that you are making with someone as well, Capricorn. Let's go ahead and let's clarify this judgment card right here. Beautiful. We have the Three of Cups clarifying judgment as the overall energy. This is a time to celebrate all right, Capricorn, um, that's the overall energy, so there's celebration going on. You have friends, family, loved ones, people around you. Um, this, this is something, this could have been a graduation as well, you guys. 
uh, or an engagement uh, with this going on because it's you're having a rite of passage here. So you could be just starting out in life, getting out of college, especially with this Hierophant right here too. Many of you could have graduated. So let's clarify this Eight of Cups for Capricorn. We have the Moon card. So, your situation with the Eight of Cups moving forward, we have the Moon card. This could represent a Pisces as well. Um, as you can see, the lights are being shined on this moon, and then there's a beam of light being shined on the river. I feel like, uh, with this showing up here, that you have not, in your recent past, maybe you weren't seeing things for what they really were, um, but you are now. Okay, I feel like that's what I'm getting from this. You've had messages. Some, you know, you have spirit guides, Capricorn, or the divine angels. They are guiding you through this situation, this rite of passage. You're being divinely guided. Let's go ahead and clarify this death card for Capricorn. What is this death card about? The Hermit. Beautiful, beautiful energy. Could be dealing with a Virgo. Like I said, some of you might need to go back because this is a, I really feel like a lot of you are starting a new path. There's there's something going on here with a, a, a new beginning or a second chance. And you spent time intro in, you know, in introspection. You have been meditating. You have been going within, gaining that inner wisdom and knowledge that you that you've needed. And this is what's helping you be able to transform. Okay. This is beautiful. So many of you, I feel like, are just starting out a new or starting a new path that you're very passionate about. What is this Hierophant in their recent past? Four of Pentacles. So the Hierophant, and we have the Four of Pentacles. So the Hierophant is somebody that I do see that is, has power and has control, uh, authority, that has structure, okay? And when you get the Four of Pentacles that is uh, clarifying it, I feel like this is stability here. I don't feel like this is, has anything to do with being a miser or holding too tightly to your finances. This has to do with power and structure. I feel like this individual has helped you, Capricorn, in, you know, in being able to move forward down, you know, whatever path it is that you're going, whether it's a new job, whatever new circumstance this is. This person has authority and power, okay? And they, I feel like they have helped you in a major way. So let's go ahead and, oof, okay. And I had one ball here. All right, we have the Knight of Cups. So this is what's clarifying this Two of Cups right here. So for many of you, you could have had somebody come in and offer a cup of love. Um... This is a romantic individual right here. This could be a Cancer Scorpio Pisces. You don't have to hold these cards to their element. Um, and here's this Two of Wands here. This is looking out. He's looking out. He has the, he's holding the world in his hands. So I just, I really feel like this is a new adventure, a new path that you're setting upon uh, Capricorn. And I feel like you have somebody that's setting out with you. Um, like I said, you could have had um, you may have a significant other, you could be getting married, you could have just made a, a, a verbal, you know, commitment, okay, with this individual, and I feel like, you know, with this hierophant here, this could have been, um, a, a preacher, this could have been somebody that, um, uh, performed a marriage ceremony as well, this is very interesting, Let's go ahead and let's clarify this Knight of Swords for Capricorn here. Knight of Swords. Here we go. Oh my goodness. <laughs> All right. So the Knight of Swords here is being clarified by the Nine of Cups, you guys. Now I have two things that are coming very clear here. You guys are, your wishes are being granted. Your wishes are coming true. Um, you're having a second chance. You are with someone. You've committed to someone. You have recently uh, committed hand fasting marriage uh, with this Hierophant being here. 
okay and the second thing is some of you may have been dealing with um, some type of addiction um, could have been alcohol whatever addiction it was um, and that could be where this transformation is coming in at um, with this hierophant that could mean institutions you know hospitals as well and you know with this celebration you know and this judgment here you know you having a second chance of rite of passage so that's the two main things that i'm getting here with these cards uh, Capricorn this is very positive whatever it is you are leaving behind whether it's addiction or just starting out your life new fresh with your partner significant other you are transforming it's beautiful um, the outcome is you know wish fulfillment dreams come true everything is in your favor here this is just an amazing reading Capricorn let's go ahead and see what the angels have to add to this reading here oh very nice we have Vanessa to make your decision ask yourself which way brings me closer to my divine purpose which may which way takes me away from it so like I said you know your angels are there they're 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 with you this is a divinely guided reading you guys that you know spirit is talking to you right now Capricorn um, I feel like for many of you, the Virgo uh, reading is uh, it's going to be important for you for some reason. It's I'm just being you know drawn to say that um, because they had a similar reading here of you know this new path, whatever direction. And always know you're never alone. You can always ask spirit, your angels, your spirit guide, whatever it is that you believe in. It's here. They're they're waiting on you to contact them. All you have to do is is open your mouth and ask beautiful so the presence of love will always cast out fear so this is beautiful this uh, gives me a feeling of you know if you get down or if you feel like you can't do this or you you know you're feeling overwhelmed always remember that your angels love you your guides love you spirit loves you cast that cast that fear out you have family that loves you you have somebody here that's that's offered you know some type of commitment to you that loves you and especially this hierophant here who's ever so helped you in some way they love you as well capricorn and they've got your back and so does the universe so please comment i read all of them this is very interesting i would like to know how this resonates with you and I want to thank all of you so much from the bottom of my heart. I wouldn't be here without you. And I will see you next time. I send you all my love and wishes and blessings, Capricorn. Thank you. Bye-bye.